playing with the splash pad. You guys, this is a miracle right now. Ever since Grayson was old enough to enjoy a splash pad, we've had this for three years now, I wanna say, and he's never liked this splash pad. Him and Porter both. And now he loves it. This is the first time I've gotten it out for the season and they both are loving it. Of course we have the water low and it's freezing cold and it's cloudy. I don't know if you can tell. It's 80, but it's cloudy, but they are loving it. They keep running to the towel and then running back to the water. I keep seeing on TikTok that Costco has like a $20 huge one of these and I'm kind of tempted to like go get it. My mom and sister have a membership that they share and I'm kind of tempted to go and get it <laughs> because now that they actually want to play, like maybe that would be a lot more fun than this little tiny one. But this is so, this is so huge. You guys don't even realize it. Like we have splash pads around the city and now I'm actually going to be able to like take them to the city ones because they used to hate them and so I would never take them to it. But now that they're playing with ours, they're going to love it. <laughs> Look how cute they are. And just wait till I get out the pool. I'm not going to do that yet, but... Once it gets really warm, then we'll get out the pool. We just have like a little blow up pool. Hey guys, I just wanted to show you that cute um, clip of the boys. They're so stinking cute. Avery's inside napping, Anthony's inside with her. And I'm just watching the boys. My sister's actually gonna come over later and hang out and Anthony's gonna go bowling with my two brothers and brother-in-law. Um, they're gonna go have fun and do bowling, but Allison and I are just gonna hang out with the kiddos. This is the start to a really busy weekend. Well, I don't know, really busy weekend. Like my sister's coming tonight and then tomorrow is gonna be a busy morning. Grayson has his last soccer game and then he also has baseball practice and they're back to back. Baseball 11 to 12 and then he has um, soccer from 12, 15 to one. Back to back and Anthony's parents are coming in town to see the kids. So it's gonna be a little crazy but it's gonna be fun. Glad that soccer is ending. And now we just have baseball, which that just goes until the end of June and then that's over. So it's like a super quick season. It's super hot today. Like I said, it's like 80, but tomorrow it's supposed to be like 60s cause it's supposed to rain all night. So not looking forward to that. We're gonna freeze. It's actually not that cold, but it's not gonna be the warmest. And I think we're gonna bring the whole family to go watch Gray's baseball and soccer games. So it'll be interesting. I don't even think I told you guys that we signed Grayson up for baseball. I might have. Um, I took him to a baseball practice, his first baseball practice a couple days ago. I took a couple clips, so I'll input those here. All right, get ready. Well, they need it. Yeah, this is your practice earlier. We're going to try to grab it. Come on. You guys got it? There we go. Is it back to your He was so cute. He loved it. His team is the Padres. Like all the baseball teams in his little league, they just take on like MLB teams. And so his team are the San Diego Padres, which I did not know that the Padres were in San Diego. I had never heard of them. I'm, I used to be a really big Detroit Tiger fan. And so I knew like baseball teams around there, but the San Diego Padres I had never heard of before. Yeah, so he is that. He got cute little jerseys and hats. He'll probably wear his hat to practice, but not his jerseys, because I think they save those for, like, games. He has, like, four practices and then eight games, so it's, like, super low maintenance. Just wanted to try something different. I think he likes baseball. It's a lot less contact, obviously, um, and, you know, they're all new, so they're all just learning, like, how to catch the ball with their mitt and how to hit the ball. And they just, like, hit it off of, like, a wiffle ball stand thing. It's, like, super low-key. Like, I don't even know that they do coach pitch. Like, it's that, like, low. 
but he's loving it and it's just something different yeah i'll take some videos tomorrow when we go to baseball and soccer but i had to get that clip of the boys because they're so stinking cute i also a couple days ago registered grayson again for soccer next year he's going to be with the same coach hopefully the same team seems like the same kids just keep signing up year after year this will be his third year doing it this next year and then i signed porter up for his first year doing soccer so that'll be super fun he'll have a different coach so hopefully he gets a, as good of a one as grayson has because great we got really lucky with grayson's because his coach is like super nice with the kids and he just emailed us all saying he wants to bring donuts to the kids tomorrow so it's super sweet so i'm hopeful that Porter will get just as nice of a coach but yeah it's so crazy we'll have two games next year which will be it'll be busy Porter's will be at like 9 a.m every Saturday Grayson's will be all over the place and then Grayson starts doing a practice during the week he do a pra one practice during the week and then a game on Saturdays so his is going to be a little more work but I'm going to keep him doing soccer until he tells me he doesn't want to do it anymore. So could be only a few years of it. Could be a ton of years of it. We'll see. But yeah, we're just hanging out in the backyard and soaking up this nice weather before my sister comes over. Yeah, this is our first summer, like full summer in this house. We didn't move to this house until the end of July last year. And so we really, I mean, we got like the tail end of summer, but not like the full summer. So this will be fun to enjoy the whole, I keep saying summer, whole season this in this house. I'm already starting to make like a bucket list of things to do this summer that I mostly want to do with my sister because I'm scared to take the kids anywhere by myself because I have three now. But I want to go to the splash pad, I want to go get ice cream, I want to go to the zoo, we have memberships to the zoo. So I want to do a lot of fun things this summer, make homemade ice cream all that fun stuff i saw a thing um, make homemade pizza never done that before but i bet the kids would love that they love pizza so that would be super fun to do it's gonna be a fun summer and a lot of kids are still in school right now gray has been out for over a week now but a lot of the kids i think go until next week and then i think they're done so we're out early but yeah it's definitely feeling like summer today <laughs> Thank you.